The Nighttime Economy Task Force is ready to draft its recommendations for the county to boost business. Council members, civic leaders, and even business owners all had a seat at the table. We're in a good place where we have a lot of ideas. I think it's now to put all those ideas on paper and kind of sit back and say, well, where do we stand right now? Members met in downtown Wheaton at Hollywood East Cafe. This restaurant is part of the cultural fabric of the neighborhood. Diversity is really important, especially here in Wheaton, because we have so many ethnic groups here. I mean, Asians consist of not only, you know, Chinese, but it's, it's Indian, Chinese, Japanese, Korean. You There's says so a designated music Asians venue is an element missing from the community, but it's difficult for restaurant owners like herself to compensate for the loss. I would probably have to get a music venue in, and then it, it's the cost of that. Tom Stanton owns an Irish pub that's walking distance from the cafe. He says more venues are needed. That's what's uh, always been kind of the, the trademark of Wheaton is the variety, the diversity of, of offerings, and, and I think that needs to continue. And to the extent that it does, Wheaton's just going to keep getting stronger for it. The diversity of Wheaton and other areas of the county are being considered in the nightlife conversation, but it isn't the sole factor leading the talks. Any recommendations that we want, we hope that they could encompass all the districts that we're looking at as a whole as opposed to specific ones. The Nighttime Economy Task Force is about halfway through meeting with experts and officials to get a better idea of what recommendations they'll be giving to the county. Now in August, they'll be able to give a draft proposal to the county so the county can identify what are the key areas they want the task force to narrow down. From IMC Media, I'm Tamika Smith.